won't quite be able to see that until she <laughs> climbs up, but I think the reaction says it all. Yeah, good morning. And this is a DT shock for Birdie. DT had a tough start today, three bogeys in the first three holes, but she gets one back there. Third round underway and finishing up at the 18th, Anna Nordquist carrying this for a 66. Oh, what an impressive round of golf. And Anna knows she's an you know, experienced competitor. Now she's got it back to even par. Reed who will drop a shot there. Big move from Gabby Ruffles today. This is at the 16th. Watch out for Gabby. She's been playing great golf on the Epson Tour. Short left. Hedgen Choi for birdie. A couple of players that could feed off each other today, Hedgen Choi and Gabby Ruffles. She's able to leave the chip shot in a spot that made for an easy putt, easier putt. Here's Alexa Pano. This was just a moment ago at the fourth. Another of those junior Ryder Cup participants. And another beauty. That's right up there with Gabby Ruffles. Tee shot here a moment ago. And just a moment ago at the 18th, Lindsay Weaver Wright just announced that she is with child and she's with Eagle at 18. A three for Lindsay. We saw how frustrated she was last week at the Meyer. Here's Lee Six for a birdie at the fifth. Yeah, it's a good spot to be below the hole there. We may see a few go in as the day goes on. So these conditions a little bit easier. Sagstrom from behind the seventh. Has she chipped it in? Yeah, nice. Just doesn't get the right energy off the face and comes up short. Just a moment to go. At the 11th. Jody, you would shut off right on the flag. It's going to roll down towards the hole. Yes, very nicely done. Won't quite be able to see that until she climbs up, but I think the reaction says it all from the crowd behind the hole. PGA champs in this pairing. Hannah Green with this woman, Danielle Kang, for Eagle. Go ahead and walk it in, DK. Second eagle of the day. This is Celine Boutier for birdie. Oh, wow. That's a bonus, isn't it? We've seen a couple of parts that have been from above the hole going downhill, hit the hole really hard. Would that still be going? Finally found a fairway, Tom. He's struggling the early going for the world number one. Not here. Oh, wow. Wonderful. <laughs> so what were we saying about hitting fairways? Dominant leading Europe to a victory. Borga at two. Left her approach about 20 feet short of this hole. Tried to chip up. Didn't judge the chip very well on that. Unfortunate misread. Just looks a little quick stroke. Haven't seen much of Borga's game, but it looks like she... Her third round, Rose Zhang. She's one under today, and here's her second at the par five. by storm with that win in her pro debut three weeks ago. She's gotten used to doing that. She birdied seven, dropped a shot at eight. This would be an outside chance for birdie at nine, but it's tracking. It is tracking, yes. So she's out in a couple under par. Advantage, this is Lynn Grant at the par three 12th for birdie. Young Swedish superstar. We've expected a lot of Lynn in her first few events as a full LPGA member here in the United States. Sand saves on tour this year, Maguire. Let's go to Ronin Yin, who won earlier this year on the LPGA tour in Palos Verdes. This is for a birdie at nine. Wow, rattling one in from long range. And Ronin Yin out in 33. And up at 16, the par three. This is Grace Kim for birdie. One of the first time winners this year on the LPGA Tour, won her first, may had her first victory in Hawaii. This is the US Women's Open champion from Olympic Club a few uh, years ago. Yuka Sasso for a birdie at the 15th. And 
That was pretty quick down the hill there. Good birdie for Yuka Sasso. 15th hole, the second hardest. Shot 75-76 at the Chevron Championship to miss the cut. Has had a much more successful week here at this KPMG. And saves it. Who knows how big that will be tomorrow.